What's going on guys? Jared here, bringing you another YouTube video, and today I got some competitive gameplay. Uh, not really, it's, I don't want to say it's a competitive, alright, I gotta say this without getting all flustered, because I've, I've tried this commentary about 40 times already, and I have realized that my commentary skills are straight ass. So, in the gameplay, it's a 3v3 friendly scrim, GSM versus Revive, and we played three maps, two rounds apiece, so six rounds total. And overall in the series, I think we tied 1-1. One one. We didn't play the last map full way through. But uh, the first map was Siege of Shanghai. We lost that map in total. Uh, we just completely got destroyed on Shanghai. Um, and basically, I can, I can attribute that to me and Hickey. Me and Hickey were playing stupid. Like, we were just, we were doing so bad. Hickey went 18-33 and 33 in one of the matches, and that's the worst I've ever seen G. Hickey do. Um, I did, you know, not much better. I uh, made some really boneheaded plays, and I really think that cost us. But thank God Kappa stepped up in this game. I actually kind of stepped up in this uh, game. I, I got kind of heated. Um, I was trying to get me pumped up the whole time, but, I, I mean, it was a 3v3 friendly. I really haven't grinded Battlefield like I should have, so my shot was a little bit off. Um, my, you know, my ment the mental part. For me, Battlefield for competitive, the mental is 90%, and the actual skill is 10%. You know, if you think you can go in there and you think you can win the majority of your gunfights and you think you can um, basically just bully around the other team, you will 90% of the time win the match. Uh, if you go in there with a negative mindset um, and not looking to get better, you, you have to lose some. You're not going to go undefeated. Um, so you just have to go in there with the mindset that you're going to get better and that your team's going to get better. So that's what, that's what I started doing towards the end, but my mind was so off focus. I was just getting so mad at myself. And like I said, I was kind of getting mad at G. Hickey because G. Hickey's never done that bad. But we're over it now. Uh, we kind of fixed ourselves. And if you notice the ticket differential, uh, I actually had to cut this video down because it was a 30 minute clip. And I cut it down to 11 minutes. So I did pretty decent on that. But we were down, I think at one point, like 170 tickets. I mean, we were getting absolutely wrecked. But we turned it around. And you'll get to see what happens at the end of the gameplay. I don't want to ruin it because it actually is. Uh, pretty decent comeback, and I'm not gonna tell you about how much. I'm not, I'm not even gonna say anything else about it. Uh, anyway, today I wanted to talk to you all about Cinch Gaming. Uh, if you saw the intro, that was a pretty sick intro. I gotta say, I didn't make it. Obviously, I got it offline. You know, we're sponsored by them, so they, they kind of sent me that intro, and I decided to use that one other than the than the uh, kind of upbeat one. I don't know if you've seen any of my past videos. The past few videos have been done with the other Cinch Gaming intro, and that thing, the thing, the, the background music is just. I don't know. It's just ass. I, I can't say anything else. I can't say anything good about it. That's for sure. Kind of pissed me off every time I heard it, but I still used it. Uh, anyway, we're sponsored by Cinch Gaming, and they're a controller company. They have other merchandise. They have hoodies, hats, wristbands. I don't know. Um, they have all kinds of stuff, cool stuff, gamer stuff, and uh, we actually have a discount code. It's a 5% discount code, uh, all capitals, RVE for Revive, obviously, and... I don't know, I just wanted to remind you all that we are sponsored by them, so if you're in need of a controller, if you're in need of whatever, um, go buy a controller, use our discount code, and I'm actually thinking about doing a giveaway. Now, I'm not 100% sure on what the giveaway would be at this point, but I know that if you use the revived discount code during the month of August, um, and you let me know, I don't know how you're going to let me know, but you let me know who you are, I will keep your name down, and at the end of the month, I will do something for each and every one of you that has you know basically bought a controller from Cinch Gaming using our discount code so keep that in mind if you if you need a controller if you need a bag for whatever reason if you need a sweatshirt uh, with Cinch Gaming or Revive on it um, go to cinchgaming.com www.cinchgaming.com uh, links will be in the description buy you something put the discount code on there and I will for sure uh, keep your name if you let me know who you are uh, email me. My email will be even be in the description. I mean, I'm just giving you everything right now. The ball's in your court. Go buy something, and then let me know, and I will hook you up with something cool at the end of the month. I'm not for sure what it's going to be, but uh, yeah. All right. So the last topic I actually wanted to cover before ending this video, or while well, ending the the commentary, but keeping the game, whatever. You guys understand what I'm talking about. Um, the last topic I wanted to wanted to really talk about was team changes. Now. We haven't really made a team change in a while. Uh, you know, Moody's on like a five-week vacation, and I think when he comes back, he's going straight to the PC. Um, so we're, we're definitely missing Mooney uh, as far as slaying power, but we're getting way better, and I, I think we, we made a really good choice here. Um, anyway, Ka Kappa, not Kappa. 
Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Dark Blade or Revive Bear or whatever. He has not been on for a while on Battlefield 4. We don't really know what's going on with him. Yeah, I've wrote him. It just seems like his head's not really in it. And so instead of just, you know, dropping him full way, um, we're just going to move him to the back right now. Uh, we're not really going to... I mean, we're, he's not really on the roster, but he... he I'm not going to drop him. Um, he's still there. He's just not there, if that makes sense. Um, he's not going to be in any of the matches until he actually shows up and plays some with us. Um, but instead of him, we picked up two more guys. So right now, the roster with Dark Blade gone, we only had a four-man roster because Mooney was on vacation. So the roster, um, after we kind of moved Dark Blade to the back, was me, Hickey, and Kappa. Um, and obviously, you can't do 3v5s, and if you could, we'd probably get wrecked because it's a 3v5. Uh, so we picked up two people, uh, two really good players, and I think um, one is probably better than Mooney uh, as far as slang, and then the other one is uh, is a really, really good, I would say he's more of an objective slayer, so anyway, if you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Mega, you guys probably have never heard of Mega, but him or MP4 Destroyer, MP4 Destroyer used to be on Team Nightmare uh, for like a week or two, and Team Nightmare was, used to be our biggest rival, we actually, we actually hated a lot of the Nightmare guys uh, for really no reason, and we picked him up, and with him came Mega, we're really happy to get Mega as well as MP4 Destroyer. But Mega, like I said, he can he can outslay the majority of anybody we, we will play against. So really happy to get him. Uh, and like I said, MP4 Destroyer is a great bonus on there. Um, I think he he probably matches up with Darkblade, if not exceeds Darkblade's uh, skill level. And uh, his dedication, you know, he's always on Battle for 4. So that, that's always good. Um, so yeah, that's what happened as far as the team. So right now, the roster, the five-man roster is myself, Kappa, Hickey, MP4, and Mega with the backup, I guess, being Darkblade. And we have another backup we just picked up. Oh, geez, I can't think of his name. Yeah, uh, it doesn't matter. Our whole roster will be on Battle Log and in the description below uh, as soon as I get the sub, the last sub name. I can't think of his name to save my life. But anyway, hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, leave a like down below. Enjoy the rest of the gameplay. Shit is about to hit the fan. We actually get a tri cap, then they get a tri cap, and then you'll actually see what happens at the end. Very, very good games versus GSN. Good games to them. Had a lot of fun doing it. Look forward to doing it more. And as always, guys, this is your boy Jared. Your boy Jared. That just sounds gay as hell. This is your. Alright, I gotta think of a good outro. Anyway, I don't have an outro, so I'm just gonna leave this in awkward silence. Your med kit, go get it.
Objective Charlie. Objective Charlie's been lost. We've taken Objective Alpha. 